Hey guys, I'm John with Hops and Brews, and today we're going to be checking out Stones Enjoy by 7421. So, like I said, we're going to be checking out the latest Enjoy by from Stone Brewing Company. This is their Enjoy by 7421 Tangerine and Pineapple. I am super excited for this because I love the Enjoy By series. So let's get it. This beer comes in at a 9% ABV, a 90 IBUs. It gets an average rating on untapped of 4.02. A faithfully independent double IPA. There's more than one recipe for independence. This edition of our Brew To Be Enjoy By Now IPA is a fruitfully fresh new variant loaded with real tangerine and pineapple for maximized summer celebrations. Whether you crack into this one as soon as you get it home or hold on to it until the 4th of July, make sure to enjoy it before the fireworks end as usual. And independence doesn't have to mean keeping it all to yourself, especially if you've got some independently minded friends and family to share it with. Well, all right, let's take a look at this enjoy by. Um, looks super golden, thick, can't see through it. Um, kind of looks like a hazy, but a lot more golden bronze. Um, where like the hazies look very yellow. This is more orange. Hmm. There's a malt on the nose and is this a tangerine? I think it's a tangerine. Yeah, there's kind of a kind of a little bit of a tangerine on the nose. It's not a big nose. That's surprising. Hmm. Alright. Super crisp at the beginning. Not as malty as a lot of the Enjoy by it's hard, but that pineapple hits right in that middle. It hits hard. There's this weird tingle tart. Ooh, a little tinny. It's probably the hot notes that I'm getting. The back end, it's 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 interesting. But that that little leftover oils is all like pineapple. It's very odd. But it's good. It's good. 9%. It's good. But I remember the uh, Enjoy by 1121, uh, Enjoy by 1120, last year's 7420 was amazing. They all had this a bit bigger malt feel, and this kind of leans itself toward more of that hazy end of the last Enjoy by. It kind of takes more of the hazy body of the last one and the hot profiles of the older ones and marriages them together and then they blend it with these really nice citra fruits. I do think you taste both of the citra fruits coming through, the pineapple and the tangerine, but there's just something missing. I, I want it to have that bit bigger, maltier flavor coming in at 9%. I, I kind of want that little bit of sweetness and it's missing that. I really do enjoy the fact that I can get this big quality IPA in a nice little 12 ounce can and at a decent price. Um, it was about three bucks. A 9% for three bucks. I got no problem paying that price for this quality of a beer. But like I'm saying, it's just missing something. Um, I personally think it needs a bit more of a malty sweetness. Um, I really, really enjoyed that about a lot of the previous Enjoy Buys. This is still a fantastic beer. I mean, if I saw it on tap list, I would have no hesitation reordering this. It's that good. It really is an enjoyable beer. It is a great barbecue beer. I actually could totally see myself chowing down on this with a nice grilled barbecue bacon cheeseburger. It would be amazing in the sun. That grease, the bacon, the cheese, and this flavor. Oh, yeah, baby. Mm. And you know what? 
You can't always have this big malt bomb every time. And I do enjoy the fact that they experiment with these Joy Bites. It's always a slightly different recipe. They always take it somewhere else. It's not the same beer every time to just have fresh. I thoroughly enjoy that. So if you are looking for a big IPA with some super pineapple and tangerine notes to it for this upcoming 4th of July, highly recommend you enjoy this before it's gone. Cheers. Hey guys, thanks for watching this video. Remember to hit like and subscribe. Follow me on all my social media stuff. The links for those will be at the very bottom of the description. And while you're scrolling down there, go ahead and leave a comment for two. Um, do you enjoy the Stone and Joy Buys? Have you got to try the latest 7421? What was your previous favorite one? I do recall the 1120 was amazing. I love that one. That one just keeps coming back to me in my memory. Cheers all.